Hello everybody, Steven here with Cardboard Coalition. And yesterday, as I was getting ready to run out the door, I found this box on my porch. Heavy box, I'm assuming if you looked at the thumbnail, um, you know what it already is. Uh, if you don't just check out these videos because they're my videos. Uh, box is like loosely put together, it's kind of interesting. I'm actually cutting the box open with this knife. See, this knife is sharp. One of the interesting things, it's it actually got shipped out from my hometown. Um, so let's go ahead and see uh, what's actually in here. There we go. All right. So, oh my jeebus. All right. So what we got here is Everdale, all things Everdale. So we got, I got to drop it down a little bit so you guys can see. So I got the windows open and my shutters want to slam because the wind. Uh, premium quality 600 sleeves. Oh, I forgot I did the sleeves. So I got all the sleeves. I went completely all in with Everdale. Now I have played this game after I went all in on it, but I'd read all the reviews. It looked like something I'd really like. And after I played the game, my friend who knows why they played the game, we know who you are, right? Um, I don't regret getting this. So here is all the plastic dishes there for all the different things. We'll get into all this. And then this is the big collector's edition box. I'm hoping that's not, well, that's the plastic that smashed there, not everything. This thing was a beast. Ugh. It's such a beast, I'm going to have to do it like this because I don't want to knock the camera more than I already am. So let's go ahead. It's interesting, there is no packaging in this. I wonder if they sent it to um, the local shipper in a whole bunch of packaging. Oh, hitting the camera. Sorry, guys. And then they put it in this and sent it here. Interesting choice. This is a heavy SOB, that's for sure. All right, but how do we do this? We're gonna make noise, there we go. Oh. There's the noise, all right. Bring in the noise, oh my God. It still barely fits in the frame and I got the camera as far away as I can. All right, so Everdale, or we'll flip it this way. And this is the complete collection. So this is everything Everdale, all right? Plus on top of it, the um, Resource vessels, so I have something to put all my my resources in Right and then this which isn't as exciting, but sleeves 600 sleeves. All right So let's uh, let's dig into this. Um, I feel like most people are gonna want to know what this is so This thing's huge. Let's see if we can flip it This is huge. This is this is not going into a calyx that's for sure, and it's it's heavy, but there we go. All right, I think this is how we're gonna have to open it. Um, promo cards inside, Everdale for everyone. Everdale for everyone, promo cards inside. All right, where is my knife? Now, you might have seen, or maybe not, all the jokes that are going around. I've seen a lot of the jokes and how big this box is. And I'm actually shocked. This box is huge. This is the um, biggest box for a game I've ever gotten. That's for sure. All right. Open, open, open. Open, slide, open, open, slide, open. I'm actually shocked they sent it with no um, Packaging and there's no dings a little bit right here, but I think that's just the box and How the box uh, Comes together like the the cover on the box Whew. All right, let's get all that out of the way my box is over there to throw everything in I usually have the box close All right, keep that in camera. All right, let's try to make this this quick um, a quicker video I guess but oh my god it's that, that tight fit. I actually do like the tight fit. It's just when you're trying to do things fast. You can kind of wiggle it. It's getting air in there to get that suction to let go. Woo wee. Oh my God, that's fancy nice inside. They got, it's lined inside. 
they definitely made sure you paid for everything you got everything plus with this all right let's go ahead and set that to the side that is a a big beast oh, i feel like god i oh you guys can see how big it is here i mean there's my forearms it's like uh, almost the forearm and all all right so what do we got in here you guys don't care about that what do we got in here i always like when they give us these it tells us how everything goes together uh where to put everything really all right how this all goes together the complete storage solution with this, I also got the um, the wooden tree instead of the cardboard tree, the fancy wooden tree. All right, there's all the assembly. Token sheets. All right, so um, I guess I didn't comment that much about the quality. It's, it's a nice, thick, heavy box, definitely heavy, but it's fitting a ton of stuff in here. All right, tokens pop out really easy, all right? Um, like I said, check out King of Average. I'm not saying he's going over this game, but he tends to talk about quality. It's a good quality cardboard, right? Um, seen thicker, th seen thinner kind of things. Put that back in there. Pop one of the big ones out so you can see. So there are tabs. Just kind of wiggle it back and forth, and it'll pop out. All right. So we got tokens. We got one sheet of tokens. Well, it's just going to go off camera, but we're going to do our best. We got one sheet of tokens, two sheets of tokens. Stay in there, little pond. Little open signs and stuff. We got three sheets of tokens. Um, this is interesting. I'm trying to think in my head, playing this, I played just the base game. These are the points. I think some of this stuff is for the expansion stuff. So they give you all the stuff for all the expansions. So it's all been reprinted here. Interesting. I mean, this game's been out for a while. What is this? Award-winning developer. Oh, Everdale's digital. You could play it. Digital's one of my friends who I know is probably not going to watch these videos. Probably shouldn't even call my friend, man. But uh, yeah, they have it digital because uh, my one friend who I know does watch these videos and is well appreciated. Um, bought this at a game swap the base not this one the base everdale and it's been an ongoing joke between us um tabletop tycoon all right so this is their games and stuff that they have coming um but the ongoing joke they like to play with me is i have everdale you have everdale who at this table doesn't have everdale because steven doesn't have everdale well now mofos steven's got everdale in spades right in mother living spades I don't like these. Like I said, I know some people do. This is the tree. This is the wooden tree. So it's thin, but it's wood, right? There's all the pieces to the tree. I'm not gonna take it all out because, I mean, it's not super thick wood, but I mean, it's wood. There's no, there's no denying it. I can't deny it. I'm a rough rider. You don't wanna mess with me. All right, you guys come here for the singing. So I'm gonna say this too, let's see if I can hold it. This is, thick plastic this isn't like flimsy i mean it, it's kind of flimsy but you guys get what i'm saying it's not flimsy like simon plastic all right miniatures all sorts and types of uh not miniatures sorry uh meeples what do you call them when they're animals maniples remember meeple doors right these things are huge it's a goat is that like a mountain goat these things are freaking huge with freaking lasers on it, right? I'm going to try and make this video quick, so I'm not going to go through all of it. It's more like a, hey, look, you do get a, a lot of stuff if you get this collector's edition. All right, so this goes to maybe, well, more to one of my friends I know doesn't watch my videos, but he says, I don't like cute things. I have no soul, I guess, but that's cute. Come on, that's freaking cute. Little Mr. Rabbit. Oh, Mr. Rabbit's. And a pink and a purple little Mr. Rabbit. Come on. Come on, a bee. Come on. Um, and I got to guess what these things are. I don't know. Um, the deformed Pac-Man? I don't know. What is. This, I'm assuming it has to be the expansion. But I'm sure once I see the picture, what it is, I'll, I'll figure it out. Oh, another rabbit. I'm assuming these are for the different players. Just going with this random little frog waving hello. Hello, Joe. 
How does it go? It's a little mouse. I'm assuming that's a mouse. An owl. No, it's another rabbit, but I see an owl right here. Oh, do they all have... Oh, wait a... Wait a... Wait a tick. We're gonna have to go through this. I thought they were all just rabbits in there, but they're not. They're not Waskoi rabbits. Oh, these are all different colors. And they have all their different... Sh oh, so I'm gonna go through one of these. The Waskoi rabbits. Okay, that's another owl. What else do we have in here? That's an owl. Okay, a whole bunch of owls and a rabbit and a frog. An owl, an owl, and an owl. And these are... Uh, I talk about a lot of times the wood being like a really light. These are a denser, it feels like a denser wood. I don't know enough about what they they make them out of and stuff like that. That's why I, was, I talked about, um, oh, and there's the white rabbit. Does the rabbit like lead some of these people and then the mice? Now yeah, I'm going back through all these. Does this one have a rabbit? This one has a rabbit too, guys. Oh my God. Nope, that's the frog. I know the rabbit's in here. If the frog's in here, there he is. There he is. And snails, this one comes with snail. Oh my God. Oh, oh my, oh my. This is crazy. I wanna get in and play. There's the frog, but this is the butterfly. Blue has butterflies. Oh, it's like, a, is that like a mirror cat? Mirror cat, oh man. This is exciting, exciting stuff. We'll just go through and see what the different ones are. There's a turtle, little turtle guy. Turtle guy. So I'm assuming these, no, that can't be that because the expansion, maybe, and they're the different people. There's the rabbit and the frog. Who is the extra in here? And then the hedgehog. Rabbit, frog, and a hedgehog. This is a hedgehog walker. If you ever watch a video, it's not a possum. All right. Rabbit. The bird is the different one in that one. The bird, a bird. Bird, bird. B -b -b bird, bird, bird. All right. Let's see. Frog. I see the rabbit from the top. Bats. They're freaking bats. Bats in the belfry. I think I called another one. No, that's a straight cat. So cats. Orange cats. You see, these are heavy enough that I'm not even worried if I drop it. Little salamanders, little lizards. What do we got here? Uh, is that a ferret? That looks like a ferret or a weasel, I guess, out in the wild. What do we got here? A fox? Looks like a fox with the face. What do we got here? Huh. That's a question mark. I don't know what that one is. That's okay. It's okay. I don't know everything in the world. Just most things. No. I don't even know most things. All right. What else do we have? Squirrel. We saw the bee. What one do we have in here? This is all exciting. Exciting. Whatever that is. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm assuming this has something to do with the expansions because there's not 20 million players in this. I thought it plays like four or five people. The box is so big, I can't even get the box, I think, to even look. There's another bird, like a crow. We got in here another. Is that a platypus? All right. A little platypus, maybe? Um, that looks like a mouse, but I called this one, I think, a mouse. Hmm, maybe, maybe that's supposed to be a rabbit? No, it's more like a mouse. All right, what one's this one? We did, this one, is this the turtle? I think this is the turtle. All right, what I noticed I didn't do was I didn't pull out these guys. I guess just show them like this. Got a peacock and a vulture. It's a rhino and a spider. Man. The things we will see. All right, fresh pack out. It's pretty dry where I'm at, so I'm assuming this stuff will, will stay pretty good. It's the problem sometimes with, they get them to fit just perfect, and then when you take them out and you want to put them back in, you're like, how does it work? How does it work, man? I don't know. So we're just going to have to set this to the side. And this is... It's not, I mean, it's, uh, it's plastic. It's gonna be a little flimsy, but this isn't, this is sturdy. This stuff's sturdy. It's actually quite surprising how sturdy it is. How sturdy is it? Hmm, what are these for? I think this is for an expansion because, an expansion? So the top shows like the, 
Can you see that in there? Yeah, a little frog. All right, underwater, a little pearl and some fishes. All right. Isn't Pearl Brook one of the expansions? And I see how this is set up, like boxes sit next to other boxes. This is well designed. All right. I have to look at something to put them all back. Oh, the stickers. I don't know if I'm gonna do this, but you can put the stickers on all the little um, meeples and stuff. So yeah, it's a mouse. Maybe a mouse and a rat. A squirrel. The hedgehog. Crazy stuff, man. Crazy stuff. All right, cards. This is where all the cards, oh, this even has some, see the turtle with the top hat? I don't know which how that's supposed to be. A little butterfly, it says Everdale on it. And this holds our card. Should we go through the cards now? It's got little foam trays in there to kind of help, or foam things to help keep them up. Sure, why not? I think that's the bottom of this, so let's just, let's just do it, man. I think promo pack, let's wait for that for the end. Let's look at these. And like I said, this is all the expansion, so I'm pretty sure it's gonna have, they're just all gonna be together. I'm, I guarantee it saves them lots of money not putting all the boxes out. Um, yeah, I'm okay not having all the boxes. I have this. This is what I have. This huge Mamba Jamba collection. It's weird not having the box right here to throw my, my trash in. I know I watch other videos, they go quicker because they just take their trash and they're like, bleh. But to me, that's weird. All right. Let's see. These all have the same backs. I think these are the, I'm going to say it wrong, but like the public square card things that you put out where you're looking for that one character the whole time and you, you could never get it so you don't win. These cards are wicka 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 whack. Linen finished. They're not whack. They're just linen finished. See, I'll try to go quick. Yeah, because they have one art for each person. The fool. I like the fool. The historian. The fool kind of messes with other people. It's kind of fun. Husband. <sighs> Having the husband waiting for the wife. Ooh, it's so annoying. All right. Innkeeper. This is an everyday life. It's my life right now. I'm a husband waiting for my wife. All right. The judge. The king. Uh, the miner, that's still miners. The monk, monkey, monkey, monkey. The peddler, postal pigeon. I like the postal pigeon. I got some good points off him before. Queen, uh, the ranger, the shepherd. He was one I was trying to find for a long time. The shopkeeper for some of the bonuses. Um, the teacher, uh, undertaker. I can't remember what that card does off the top of my head. I think I remember using it. The Wanderer. Uh, the Wife. The Wife. The Wife. The Wood Carver. Wood Carver. Uh, the Castle. The Cemetery. The Chapel. Clock Tower. Courthouse. Crane. So in this game, you're basically building up. If you haven't played it before, you're building up your like village. Right, and then you get points for what you have there, and there's rules to why you have it, and, and it'll give you extra bonuses at certain points and things like that. It's a fairly fast pace. It looks like it's super in depth, but it's a fairly fast paced um, game. General store, uh, and I realized I wasn't reading them. You guys might not care, so I was pointing at the farm, right? And then the general store, the inn. We're almost through these. Uh, the lookout, the mine. I think these are all just the the main game one is so far the monastery, the palace, the post office, uh, resin refinery. Some of these, maybe I don't remember as much. Some I do. I remember the ruins. Um, the school and the storehouse. All right. Where did you cards come from? Man, this storage solution is just, it's just crazy. Here's some more. Uh, Night Weaver's Lair, main deck, base game. Oh, these are dividers. Okay. We'll go through those after. 
help me divide up all the cards. Um, I'm going to have to remember how I put them in here so I can go through and organize it. I'm a, I'm a weird person like that. I like the, actually enjoy the organizing part of it. I don't enjoy the trying to cut without cutting your cards. That I don't enjoy. Why don't I put a little rip cord on the side? Because it doesn't always work. See? Good idea, good intentions, doesn't always play out. I don't know if they spend lots of extra money to have that there, but it doesn't always work out, man. It doesn't always work out. All right. Another huge stack of cards. How about we do this in like a divide? We'll go like that. And a divide. I won't read them all, just kind of flip through them so you can see them. I'm assuming this is maybe like Pearl Brook because that's like the underwater part. Yeah. And then these have different backs. So this is probably one of the other expansion cards. I've never played the expansion, so I don't know what they bring. This is obviously three people can go there. I get that much because, like I said, I have played it. How many expansions were there? Yes, you know, we're into a different one. Like I said, I need to just go fast. There's a lot in here. I try to keep the video at least at 30 minutes. Where are we at? I got nine minutes to finish. So we'll just go through this really quick. Uh, administrative errors. Public. So I wonder if these are kind of things that you run through. Oh, and I remember there's one called spider something, right? And there's the spider. I'm assuming that's what that is. Uh, oh, yeah. I said I was going through these in two, two goes. I'm like, wait, where are those cards from? All right. So here's more of these, like the challenges, maybe more challenges to add. It's interesting. Oh, no. These are linen finish. Some of the linen finish seems a lot smoother than some of the other linen finish. Yeah, I know I'm going through them quick. You just kind of... I got these. I don't know what's going on here. Market. Market cards. They look similar. Now it makes me wonder how many players, because there's a ton of market cards here. Market cards, market cards. Power grabs. These look like more. More of the challenges. If you guys have played these expansions and you know, what one do you think I should uh, try to crack into first? Um, I want to play the, the main game again a couple times to get it down. These look like they're like future cards telling us the future. Toast to the new champion. Everyday will complete collection. Oh, I see. Everyday will complete collection. We should have opened it from this side, maybe. Everyday will complete compl collection English. When you win, take a photo with the back of this card to memorialize your victory. Share your experience on social media. Toast to the news. That would be, how do you make that your background and take a picture? Huh. Oh, that looks fancy. All right. So there are, ooh, bumping the camera. Sorry, guys. There are those cards. Let's, I guess, set them facing this way. So I remember how these cards are kind of set in here and that they are in different packages. I don't know if that matters. These look like more of the main campaign stuff because of that back, but this might be the extra people you add from the expansions. I think this might be all the main game. I can ask my, my one buddy who picked up this game, see what he thinks, but see the backs. I think these are all the, um, all the extra characters you get from the expansions and all that. So let's go ahead. I'm just going to zoom you doom through them. I'm not going to read them all because of time. You guys can get a, a glance at, get a yonder, get a gook, 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 gook. Huh. Now, as I stop to read them. Yeah, all these, these have to be expansion stuff because I've seen him before. Oh, I know I've seen him. I think I bought his set of cards at some point because I was like, oh, I'm getting this game, so... Just to like fill out the order to get the free shipping. I think I bought his cards. <laughs> Uh-oh. So I think I got extra him. Now I'll give them to my buddy. That has this game. Give him some more people to kind of throw into his game. 
I shouldn't though. It kind of it encourages them to buy the games that you already bought just because. No, I'm just kidding. It was an honest mistake, but now it's, it's become a funny joke. So yeah, it looks like it's just a bunch more characters that you have to play with that do different things. There's the little weasel. And he's the diplomat. That's awesome. All right. I'm not supposed to be reading these. Just kind of showing you guys the art really quick. And there's a lot of cards. A lot of cards. So many cards. I don't know when the cards are going to stop. Oh, this has to be the spider one because there's spiders and, and butterflies. Spiders and bugs and stuff. Oh my. There's more farm. Farm in the winter. Cool. Is that farm in like the spring? All right. There's a pumpkin. Nice. And the art in this game is, is just beautiful. And these are similar to the other ones. All right. Or at least the pictures, they're different backings. So these are all the expansion. Um, hit it again. How? Which way do these go? Yep. So let's go like this. The expansion cards for all the expansions. And I believe they set this up so they could be sleeved in here. Oh, and I got the sleeve, so we will see. And there's all these. All right. Don't stab your finger. All right, we're going we're gonna to try this side. So I know it looks like I don't know what I'm doing, but it looked like there's a point to catch there, and it's not. It's, it's covered over. I think the points were actually on that side. All right, so maybe I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> all right jump throw that off oh i do see the cardboard already starting to bend up a little bit over here i mean it, it's dry here and it happens like once the game is out then the let's see if we can we'll just show the back so you can see the back art on some of these you want to see some back art these are upside down they put my my collection thing the other way these i think are going to be the cards for the main game these are probably expansion ones because they look different. All right, all right, let's do this. Let's take about half of them. We'll put these like this. Like, yeah, more resources. These don't look like that, though. These look like they're different. Guess I'll get those closer so you can see them. Heat wave, oh, that's cool. And you go through different points in the weather. All right, I think that means the big ones mean as many people as they want can go there. Oh, I have to look at the rules. So it gives you some stuff. Oh, these are the, um, these are like the challenges that you meet. Yeah, the monastery and the wanderer, I remember these. First person to get these things then can claim this and then you have to put a person there and then they get the points. Yeah, I remember this takes one this is a worker placement game if you don't know if you're still hanging in there and you have no idea what this is it's a worker placement game sorry sniffling a little bit i have the windows open and it is cold out but i like it a little colder and then these are it changes another area where you have certain um resources that you can get but this is a worker placement game which is one of my friends like to pick on me i do say worker replacement a lot because the first worker placement i ever played was um Raiders of the North Sea, and that's a replacement game because you place and then you take another one. So I always think of it as a replacement game. All right, here's some more of these. It just changes up the game, what you can get in that area, how you go about winning and building your people up. All right, here's some of these cards. I'm assuming maybe this is expansion. I'm assuming this is some expansion stuff. I'm sure something will tell me somewhere so I can figure it all out. Like I said, it looks like there's dividers, so you can divide the game all up, and you know what's what. So when it's time to play, I wonder if the dividers are slightly bigger than the cards. I hope so. I mean, what, I like that bear. What kind of dividers would they be if they weren't slightly bigger? Are these wanted cards? Most wanted. The people in the villain, he looks suspicious. I don't like pigeons. All right. Nice. Looks like the most wanted. Oh, okay, and that one went upside down. That's where it got flipped. 
And then the complete collection. This is just letting you know that it's the complete collection in English. No Mickey Mouse. All right. Oh, hitting, hitting again. One day I'd like to have this set up up there so it hangs down. But right now this is... Got to gotta work with what I got, man. All right, let's see what else is in here. Let's keep this. They think that's supposed to be to keep this stuff nice, I hope. Or maybe not. Oh, oh, oh my. Oh, oh my. What do we got here? This is the rule book. This is a scary rule book. I agree. It, it's scary looking. But remember, this is all of the games put together. Or is this multiple rule books? So what do we got here? The Archives, the Comprehensive Everdale Rulebook. Well, it's not going to have a guide at the back. This is set up almost like a graphic novel, or like a not cheap as this is cheap, but like the the cheap books. They don't have the whole backing and stuff at the stores and or at the school and stuff. So, development team credits. I really hope there's an index in the back of this. How to play Mistwood Guild Guide Book. I'll play Mistwood. That's the spider one. Okay, this. Okay. So it doesn't. There's New Leaf. There's Spire Crest. There's Pearl Brook. I know there's a Pearl Brook one. Uh, Belfair. How to play Solo. All right, so this is the regular Everdale. This is fancy. I don't even know if I want to bust this out for rules. It's so fancy. All right, is there a. There's components, that's gonna be fun going through all that. Table of contents, at least there's that in the beginning so I can find everything that I wanna to go to. All right, well, I guess I could have gone like this. Cause that goes like that. Oh, I could put this on top too. You guys like, what are you doing, Steven? Just go back to showing this stuff. All right, so the archive, Everdale, icon reference. Introduction, table of contents. Oh, is this kind of gives us references to everything? Oh, I think this maybe does. Night weave, plot cards. Night weave, plan card. I mean, this thing's fancy. I mean, if you're into Everdale, this is the way to do it. I keep thinking it's beat up really. Oh, it is bent a little bit, but I think it's from the stapling and stuff. Spring, summer, there's the seasons. All right, I don't know how this is put together, but this is all the extra stuff, I guess. All right. So if you wanted a ton of rules to read, there you go. Rules, fools, rules. I'll probably keep that to keep everything uh, together. All right, we got more stuff. So we have this. I would argue that this should be flipped the other way. Like that. Right, so this is Everdale sitting up and it shows you kind of what goes in everything. And then all this plastic, like I said, plastic's flimsy, but it's not like, super flimsy. All right, so let's see all the stuff. We got the pearls. This is all the, well, let's, let's start with the, the stuff that's not as interesting. I have no idea what these are for, but they're in here. And we have a ton of bags. In need of bags? We've got your back. And they're punched, that's what I like. I need to get a punch to do that. I mean, if I haven't said before, we got some dice. You can get uh, jewelry bags, and they will. Uh, you can put um, things in there. Jewelry bags. You can get the small jewelry bags that are about that size, or medium jewelry bags. There you go. All right, I'm going to do this right now because I can just dump them in here. But we got some amber. Is it amber? Is what it's called? So I got this. It comes with all the fancy resources. We got the pearls. We're not gonna rip this one open because it goes like this. I am probably gonna dump all these out of the bag because I don't need them in the bag. They're all right here. There's the pearls. All right. Um, what else do we got in here? Stones. Oh, this, this is a lot of the cardboard stuff is that stuff. Here's the stones. They're plastic. They kind of feel like really light rocks, maybe. Let's take more time, and I know I said I was just going to throw them back in there. All right. We got stones. I'm stoned, man. What is this? I can't get it out. These are some crests. Oh, hitting the I hit the camera with my head. 
I was getting so into this. I was looking down, and then I hit with my head. I was acting like you guys weren't here with me, but you are. We are. I am. Uh, maybe this gives you certain things when you flip it over. We'll have to figure out. Are they different? Oh, yeah, they're different. Nice. There's that, whatever those are. The squishy berries that everybody everybody loves about this game is the squishies. Come here, squishy face. You got the squishy little berries. All right. Boom. Those would go back in the easiest way. I threw them in there. All right. We got coins. Metal coins. Nice and shiny. We got our six pointers here. I like to get a couple in my hand. I feel like I got some change in my pocket. Got sunshine in my pocket. I know that's a song. I'm probably saying it all wrong. You're like, I don't come here for you to sing, bro. I come here for you to show me things, man. Shut your mouth and show me things. I'll show you a whole new world is what I'll show you. All right. More coins. There's your threes. These are the coins you can see the sixes right here. All right. And will I punch all those? Yes, I will definitely um, punch all those and get rid of that big cardboard. I don't think I'm going to need it. They've designed this so great. I don't think I need it for it to lay flat or anything. You know, I'll just get rid of the, the cardboard here. A lot of times I'll keep that and put it underneath. It's like spacing. I guess I'll go over here to the last set of coins. We got our ones. Man, this thing is massive. Just to do the coin sound. All right. I notice I'm ready at the 30. Ready at the 30, man. Oh God, I'm past the 30. Oh, fudge on a stick, I'm pushing 60. All right, here are, I don't know what these are supposed to be. They're just brown, brown wood things. All right, let's get that out of there. And like I said, I'll put these in, put these back in later. All right, little bag, just go in there. All right. We got these ones, here's yellow ones. We'll, we won't get them all out and stuff, but I'm gonna open the bag because it'll close up better without this in there. It'll fit back in there better. Anybody want a bunch of uh, silicone, uh, gel packs to keep your stuff fresh i got them 5.99 per pack of five all right wooden logs it's the wooden man and a fresh pack we know what we're doing with those fresh packs all right so i know i put all these back in here maybe i shouldn't have um there's these trays that are all in cardboard trays to help you move everything around. Oh my God, and that's another, it's got another thing with more um, lids on top and everything. Let's set that one down like that. What do we got in this one? And I'm assuming under this is the boards. Oh my God, and there's all the boards and another one of these. All right, all right. Are you excited? I'm excited. Once again, I think this should be turned so oh those are i think all those wooden things there's little stickers to put on them i think this should be turned like that because of the picture and how you would open this all right oh i got lids everywhere it's gonna be fun putting it all back let's go ahead and look at this these are cardboard not the thickest not the thinnest uh some people might know what these are but these are I don't think these are additions to the board. I think these become your area, your little village that you build. I'll have to look into it. Are they different on? Are they different? No, it's just, that's interesting. Yeah, cause that is that one, right? Yeah, hmm. They're different on both sides, but just randomly. I guess you can pick between the two. This looks like it's the, the rules, that's like the Everdale City thing. I think that's what that is, some rules. But then there's these things. All right, cool, cool. I don't gotta punch these out. These just go in there. We have some more stickers. Score pad, looks like I'm gonna have to laminate again. We got lots of stickers. Oh yeah, see, these are brown stickers and these are yellow stickers. So these are, have to be what the, all those circular round things are. Uh, here's the Everdale, fancy Everdale bag. Oh, fancy. I feel so fancy. All right, so there's that. Let's put this on top. 
All right. There's so much good stuff. All right. And there's this one, which it looks like they just, whoever put the box in, put it in, um, just put it in sideways, that's all. I don't know. For fat, I know this is supposed to be so you can pop it off, but my fear is that none of it wants to. It's catching somewhere. And it makes me, makes me nervous. It makes me so nervous. You guys are slowing down my video. Not you guys watching, but how they made look. I could put this whole thing up because it's connected. Because it's supposed to have a nice, nice tight connection. Yeah, see, it says Everdale on it, man. He's... Ooh, this is fancy. You're paying for the fancy. This is velvet lined. That's, ooh, that's fancy. I'm pretty sure this is all the boards. So you go like this. Oh, yeah, I feel the board where you, there's one of the expansion things. I'm gonna get lost in this, so I gotta kinda set it down like that so I remember. This is the, ooh. It's the main board. The tree goes right here, so I kinda set it upside down. This uh, game does definitely become a table hog. Cause I mean, this is the main board where you, you grab things from and all that. I'm always worried when these things fold up. I think it goes like that. All right, and then these are, so there's all the, the game expansions, which expand your board. So there's one. All right, I think, I think there's another. So it expands the board further and further out. And I've heard mixed. I heard don't play with all of them, and I've heard play with all of them. And here's another one, and this one's set in this is the last one. It's a little choo-choo train coming through town. Toot toot. All right. So I'm not going to make you watch me put all this back in. What I will do is go through some of this stuff. Let's just look at them really quick. This was the card stuff. These are the dividers, I believe. So we got the Night Weaver's Lair, uh, Through Every Season, Corrin, Evertrail, Spire Crest, Pearl Brook, New Leaf, uh, Rugwort. I'm about 100% sure I bought this. Rugwort, Extra Extra, Legends, Main Deck. And then these are for the smaller ones. Uh, there's Visitors, New Leaf, Player Powers, Bellfire, Fair, um, Bellfire, Bellfair, uh, Spire Crest, uh, Pearl Brook, and base game. So these are all the dividers. So you can divide all the cards up once you're ready. But wait, there's more. I realized I completely forgot all this stuff, which is all, I believe, all the promo extra stuff that came uh, with the game. Oh, and this is taped to that. Interest, interesting choice, bro. So this is the other thing that happens out here, static all the time. You guys are like, this video is so long, but I can't get it off my fingers. Oh my God, it's gonna take two hands. Now it's stuck to this hand. Now it's, I feel like I should be filming this because it's never ending. All right, there we go, I got it off. All right, let's go ahead and look through these cards and then we'll check out this card right here. All right, so it looks like some of the main game, probably critters and stuff. Um, so let's go ahead and flip it over. Uh, Everdale for Everyone promo deck, uh, rules for compatibility between printings. Okay, that might help out, a little guide. Uh, Clarissa, that's the mom, they gave the mom a name. Caleb, isn't that the dad? James, Jeremiah, Josh, oh, they got names, they've named them. These have no names. These are the no name. You put your own name on them, man. I'm not going to write names on these cards if that's what you think I'm doing. It's not going to happen, bro. Gatherer. All right. Do, 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 do. Um, the harvester. Harvester. That's interesting. A lot of them are blank. Farm, 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 farm. And McGregor's Market. Nice. All right, there's all those. And then there's these little extra ones right here. 
which this is taped to this. Like I said, interesting choice. It's probably a good way to keep everything together for themselves. That tape came off relatively easy. And it's sticking, not the tape, but the static cling to my hands. All right, and then let's see what these extras are. And the video will be done, I promise, guys. The video, the video will then will be done. Oh, it's wrapped around, so just a regular pack. Smart to do that instead of making one just the size of this. Let's slide these out really quick. And we got uh, Doctor and the Postal Pigeon. All right. And then we got the uh, fairy and the harvester. All right, so those go with those, obviously. That is everything. This is everything that comes in um, the Everdale Complete collection. So this is everything Everdale. See if I can, can I put it like that? Nope, it won't fit in frame. Can I put it like that? Yeah, kinda, but it looks probably a lot better when it sits like that. That's everything that comes in this beast, All right? So hopefully you guys enjoyed um, Starling Games, I guess I should say that. This is from Starling Games. That's everything that comes in the uh, complete edition, except for, whew, pop this off just because I'm putting things on top. I almost forgot. I glanced off to the side. There's so much in the main thing that I almost forgot. I don't even remember what that goes to anymore. All right, except for this. So let's jump in this. I'm assuming you guys don't want to see uh, the sleeves, but I can pop it really quick. Oh man. So that isn't the end. False, false ending. If you guys tuned out, you guys tuned out. That's fine, I get it. I did a false ending. What's worse than that, a false ending or a false dichotomy? You only have two things you can do, live or die. Well, I can live as a zombie, then I'm alive and dead. What do you think of that? All right, no more false dichotomies. All right. Come on. This is, like I said, all the um, extra vessels. I figured, because I was going all in, I was going super fancy with this, I might as well get the uh, whole shebang, bling it out, spend the extra money, do the absolute complete bling I can do with this. And I know you can do Etsy and get a whole bunch of stuff, but this was just straight from them themselves. So we have the little vessels. You have the boat. It's for boat the boat stuff, you have the different acorns. All right, I know you guys want the video to be over and if you're hanging in here, I should appease you. Oh, there's a little cart, I wonder if this is the amber goes in here because normally you put it down on the, on the board, you just throw them out there, but this gives you things to kind of throw them in. Isn't that cool? We got some nuts, man. It's even printed Everdale on there, everything, all right. We've got a little harvest basket. I mean, these are these are well done, guys. Come on, I don't know. If, can you guys see that in there? I can't tell from my angle. It's like the weaving kind of thing like this in there. Nice, 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 nice. And the pearls. Pearl. Oh, man. Oh, oh, man. I wonder if that middle thing's there so it can you can do the pearls a lot easier. I am not 100% sure what these are, but these are little um, plastic... Leafs, we got the different colors. You guys can hear them. I'm assuming maybe for one of the expansions. All right, and they all have the Everdale thing stamped on the back. I'm excited. Other people might not be. I'm excited. All right, just, get sh just shove you in there like that. Yeah, you're gonna go in there and you're gonna love it. Yeah, I love it. I love the box. All right, I'm getting loopy. That's how much stuff's here. I'm just loopy talking through it. Blurbity blurb, blurbity blurb. How am I going to play video games if I have to organize all this? Who knows? Only God knows. All right. And so that's a quick, this shows you 600 cards, right? You have 300 art sleeves. You have 100 clear sleeves, 150 clear sleeves in the different sizes. Um, and of course, it's a 63 by 88. These are the basic main one most card sets use. But you got those. You got these for your small cards. And I'll just show you the art. That's the art for the cards you would put in this one. So that is everything. Uh, one, the first part was everything that comes in the complete collection. And then these were the extras um, that I got. I guess I can set them in there. You guys can kind of see them as I close it down, right? The sleeve set and then the deluxe resource vessel. And then of course, the complete collection. I don't know why I keep putting it like that. 
it just looks good for the video and the complete collection. Oh my God, a 15 minute video. I better sign off right, right now. Oh God, it doesn't want to go where I want to go. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that unboxing of the complete collection plus a little bit of extra bling um, of the complete collection of Everdale. Now I'm just rambling. Catch you guys in the next one after I hit the camera. Thanks for watching. I'm Steven with Cardboard Coalition. Bye.